we've had a tremendous 10 months um, and it's flown by and if you add Covid into that as well it makes it makes it even more um, unbelievable what what we've achieved um, we've we've settled the cost base of the college it's now financially sound um, we've improved learner outcomes to the highest the college has ever had within those 10 months. We've appointed a new senior management team, which is probably the most highly experienced senior management team I've ever put together. We've put a whole new middle management tier together and we've spent hundreds of thousands on teaching and learning and refurbishing uh, many, of the, many of the buildings. And there are also many, many plans in store to, to turn this old building into a proper wow factor for St. Austell. Yeah, I mean, one of the one of, one of the biggest, most exciting projects we're working on um, is to give St. Austell something to be really proud of for post-16 education. And we're looking to do a 20 to 24 million pound build on this site, um, which will be something special. Um, and at the moment, we're looking to go to planning in December um, to put that forward. And what I want to do is to create a campus that is for the local community. And I want to involve the local community. What do they want on it? Um, and we're starting to have those conversations and over the next sort of um, three to six months uh, that will inform the overall design and what included in the, in, in the plan because I want to really raise health and well-being and the sports activities and those things and it will be interesting to see where it ends up but we're looking forward to having creating something really special in St Austell for post-16 education. And you've got several uh, campuses across Cornwall and in Devon too. Um, you've already done some uh, serious work at, at Camborne, for instance. So t tell us a little bit more about that. Yeah, we've rationalised Camborne. We've moved the heart to the centre to really create a vibrant campus with a new reception and a new car park and greatly moved it together. But listen, there is some fantastic stuff going on in the college already. We've got boat building in, in Falmouth. You've got animal care uh, being delivered at New Key Zoo. We've got horticulture being delivered at, at Eden. How many colleges could say that? So, I mean, there is some fantastic stuff. And then you add the land-based stuff in as well with, with equine, agriculture, horticulture. Um, we've got people coming from Canada and Spain bringing their horses with them to learn within the Cornwall College group. There is some really exciting stuff going on.